Hello YouTube! I am here to show you an example of how to use my multi-touch engine for GameMaker Studio. What this engine does is, if you use something like an Android device or some sort of touchscreen device, and you go to try to use GameMaker to use mouse check button pressed or whatever, uh, it will actually only detect with one one finger on the screen. If you try to hold down your finger in one area and click in another, GameMaker will not detect that. So I've made this engine to combat that so you can actually do that feature. I will also be adding more functionality to this uh, in the future for things like telling an X1, Y1, X2, Y2 coordinates to click, as well as 3D click engine as well, so you can also click in a 3D workspace. But first, let's start off with showing an example of how to use the engine. First things first, before you use this engine, you will need to call mt underscore init. This will initialize some uh, settings variables I will be actually implementing later to actually work with setting up the system. The settings will include things for like how many different in inputs you want to detect or. By default it will be 10, but you can set that later. Anyway, so M let's go ahead and do create, add some code to the create event, and MT init. Alright, and then let's go ahead and add to the step event so you can see an example of how it actually works. So if MT mouse uses the same arguments as mouse check button and pre uh, button press and everything, so you don't really have to change anything around just the function name and be left for what mouse you button you want to actually detect for. So, then let's say show message hello world. Alright, let's actually make do pressed. That way it isn't spammy. Alright, so I've already added it to the room right here. As you can see, I'll object zero. Go ahead and run the game. I'm going to pause this video while this does, or not actually, that's pretty fast. Clicky! Hello world. I cannot really show you on my Android device, like I said, because it does not. I don't have a screen recording software on it. Um, but I have tested it on the device and I've tried clicking multiple different fingers down at once, and it works just fine. Uh, okay, guys, thank you for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, and download this engine. It's really useful. It only costs two dollars. Right, thanks for watching.